What's up YouTube? I just wanted to show you how I was driving my hydrogen converted Ford Fusion turbo diesel on the road. So here you can see how I'm opening the hydrogen. You can just about hear it uh, when it starts going into the engine and you can see the RPMs increasing which means that the hydrogen is actually producing power and it's it's definitely a usable power it's funny way actually when you turn the knob you can feel how the car accelerates which is a little bit weird you're used to feel the car accelerate when you press the throttle but <laughs> with this you feel it uh, with a twist so yeah it definitely does work uh, the only thing I have to do is uh, keep the foot pressed on the throttle so that I achieve that pilot diesel jet and you can see a little bit more about that in the video I'm gonna link uh, in the full video I'm gonna link in this shirt and uh, it was really interesting to notice that the engine does produce power sounds pretty normally uh, apart from in the very low rpm range and at high load so let's say third gear 1000 100 uh, rpm when you add a bunch of uh, hydrogen you really do start hearing the pinging noise which is quite unusual to hear on a diesel engine like this uh, but it definitely does happen and um, obviously that's because of the timing because uh, the engine is going to have a very early um, injection and when you add hydrogen hydrogen burns much 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 quicker than diesel and that's why you hear that so that's not really good for the engine but obviously in a short test like this it's not a problem either so when you when you just want to uh, drive it in a normal RP, rpm range like around 2000 rpm which is not an uncommon for a diesel it sounds pretty normally it develops power and i was very surprised uh, that it worked so fine uh, in essence i am very happy with the test i think it has proven everything i wanted to see and please do stick around because i'm gonna be showing further tests with hydrogen but not anymore on a diesel engine but on a normal spark ignited engine a petrol engine so stay tuned see you in the next video